You guys know what this is. The finale of Vox Machina. This, this is it. <laughs> this is it, man. And I'm so glad to be watching this. But it's so... It's bittersweet. Every, every, like, every finale for a reaction or a show, it feels bittersweet because it comes to an end. All good things must end. That's true. You know, like, everything has been leading up to this moment. And I, I can't express how grateful I am to the Critter community and everyone who's taken their time out of the day to just sit down and watch my reactions to this fantastic series that has been going on. And it's been such a fun ride all the way through. These characters have been going on through so much, and each one had a great addition to the show. Like, I didn't feel like any of their backstory was left out, like, or we missed out on any backstory. And I, it didn't make me feel like I was missing anything as a new viewer. There's a lot of story in episodes when it comes to the stream and the campaign for this show. But I I got what I was wanting from, from a high fantasy medieval show. Like, I got what I wanted. Like, all the characters, they had their own addition in their own way. I didn't feel like I was missing anything. And I think that's what's most important about having a show only having 12 episodes and like there's so many streams and like other other content that can be delved into and, and watched so it's just like bravo to that that's just like top top priority is making sure you're not left wanting more of course i'll want more but you know what i mean like i, I feel like i got what i wanted but will delilah win in the end of all things maybe but i feel like if she doesn't then that can lead into season two because i know season two for the show so i know like percy had his whole backstory um, issue going on with the Dorolos getting murdered by Silas and Delilah. So maybe we'll dive into some other like, characters' backstory in Season 2. Because that was a big thing for this show and making your own character for Dungeons & Dragons and having your own character in their backstory. So everyone's, everyone's character had a lot of meat on the bone. And I, I am all here for it. I'm, season 2 will be on this channel. I can't wait for that. But as for this episode... Even more shit's about to go down. <laughs> I mean, this is it, man. Uh, let's just hop right into this, and I'll give my little review of the whole season afterwards. No. An Alexa. Try this, quickly. Everything has been leading up to this, man. Anybody can die. It's not working. Anybody. We're losing her. Oh, shit. The whispered one did not return. What the fuck are you talking about? Keyleth is still breathing. Something's not right. Mm. Uh, let me try, uh... Skinner's hand! No. The elixir? My spell? That thing must be blocking all magic. Damn it, he's right. Yeah. Away from the orb! What? Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> hey! Let's move, big guy! I don't know if that was the best idea, Grog. Hey. Easy. I got it from here. Thank you, Krog. Wow. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Hold up, hold up. Skeleton's hand! Yes! We got Thumbs back. up! Vex, another elixir. Oh my god! I need it. Hurry! No way. I'm getting I'm chills. So sorry. Bro, what? Wait. Herbs. What else did she use? There's gotta be a way. Short halt! Need that magic! Uh, the spit? Disgusting mud and spit. Turn into some healing shit. There you go. What more could I lose? And me. No. Oh. Your pain will linger. I'll shatter your ankles, my sister Vesper. Your hands belong to Julius. Each Tirola will have their pound of flesh until I flay the skin from what's left of you. Oh, okay, Jeez. Percy, taking this a little far. Hey, why don't you just blow it? Oh, wait a minute. The fuck? The fuck? Oh! Taste the pain you inflicted upon my family. The smoke. I thought she meant he was just depressed. Something has possession of you. Depression. And we are better for it. Hey. What? Percy! That's not Percy. Caleb. Yo. It's a demon. Look. She's back. Okay, so this really is a Jekyll and Hyde situation. Left. Oh, so it's... He's feeding Sorry, a, what are you doing? a demon whenever he puts that on, pretty much. Caleb. Step aside. 
she's alive at least. You're going to shoot me too. Please. Take off the mask. Chill. Mmm. <laughs> Dude. It won't let me. He can't control it. Yeah, no. Don't do it. Yo. You can't. Stop. I don't know what else to do. No. No. Mm. Wow, this is scary, man. This is scary. Whoa! From killing Delilah. Piece of cake. <sighs> Dude, was he trying to kill himself to take the demon out? But she belongs to me. Wow. Stem versus Percy. No, no! I'm afraid I must. Dude. Tough, dude. Bastards! This poor character. Goody. Now I get to use my new toy. Hey, Grog, you can't. I was only gonna chop him a little. Get yeah, careful with that. <laughs> He's still calling our name, dude. <laughs> Matter, son. Not hungry. You look pale, boy. Like you've seen a ghost. Yeah. Himself. Ooh. Right. Dude, that thing looks so cool. But it's not good. Oh! Oh, that voice. Oh my god. Family slaughtered, a legacy lost. You must avenge us. Please, son, you must. <gasps> Sorry, mother. <laughs> oh, oh, Scanlan. Fight. Yes. <laughs> hey, no, it's not. It's not him. Don't do it. I did. Max. Wait, no. What are you doing to me? <laughs> Giving you what you want. Look at that. Yes. Who are you? You know exactly who I am. You summoned me by an unspoken. When he made the pepper box. Deep down, you remember. Welcoming my help. Welcoming the rage that fueled you to create. Wow, okay. The weapon. What are you talking about? Forged in iron and smoke. We struck a bargain. I gave you the means for revenge. You're his sister. Reach him. <sighs> yeah, it's a deal with the devil. Kills people and feeds souls. And he kills who he wants. I know you. This isn't who you are. But it's taken over him. I want to be. Yes. Hate feels good. It drowns the pain. Yep. I've seen how easily it consumes you. Careful here, Cassandra. Careful. It's all I have left. No, you have your sister back, dude. If you reclaim yourself, you won't hurt the ones you love. Mm hmm. Find the real Percy within. Find my brother. Yep. Percy! Come on! We can make it! <sighs> mm. You. You did this to me! This and you'll pay! Stinking ghost. Please. 
Please, Percy! Don't forfeit your own soul! Wow, don't forfeit your own soul. You know to trust, Percy. Yet that thing was telling others their souls yes, were forfeit. I do. Wow, that's cool. Fight back! Oh my gosh. Shot his own hand. How fitting. Even in your moment of triumph, you still managed to fall short. What? You had the chance to kill me, and you failed miserably. This I mean, surprise me, though. <laughs> You're as spineless as your parents. <laughs> Fuck off. Silas is gone. I know that suffering. Losing one's family is a wound that cannot be mended. Mm -hmm. At least he saw the sunlight one last time. Damn. I knew we saved <laughs> the wrong to He returns. Cities will fall. Titans will rise. Rivers will flow with the blood of... Oh, shit! Ooh! Ooh, clean! Oh, sliced. I love a good kill like that. Gave her brother, but I could not. Wow, look who ended in blood. That was a cool shot. Yeah, da, 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 I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Regardless of its origin, it can still prove to be an effective weapon. What? Are you forgetting the smoke? And, and the whole I'm insane with vengeance thing? The demon is gone, Scanlan. The curse is lifted. All he had to do was shoot himself? Yeah, maybe you're... Nah. <laughs> yeah, maybe nah. <laughs> you know huh. how much that cost? How bloody long it will take me to make enough... <laughs> oh, yeah, okay, never mind. I'll be damned. Thank you, Scanlan. All of you. Hell yeah, you got a sister. You know alive. Still in there. Total guess. Total guess from Scanlan. Cool. Still quite a few questions, but that's okay. Oh, handsome. <laughs> Scanlan Shorthalt, rebel leader. Yeah, you've probably heard of me. Anyway, I may need a bed tonight. You see, freedom fighting is tiring work. I was just wondering if maybe... Huh? Uh -huh. <laughs> survive the apocalypse, Scanlan. <laughs> they don't need your gonorrhea. Oh, hello, Ew. Mr. Giant. I see you! <laughs> so... I hope Pike's okay. Your adult life has been driven by fear and vengeance. That's not the temperament of a leader. But you, Cass, of all our family, you were the bravest. Mm. You are the true heir to Whitestone. Me? But our betrayers, they turned me. Our people will see me as a traitor. Mm. They will see you as a survivor. Everyone here suffered from the Briarwoods, but you endured it. Yeah. We live as Good good point there, Percy. I uh, I meant what I said yesterday. Aw. I know facts. And it's the first time anyone's ever said that to me. But we have responsibilities. It's to true. the realm, to my Aramente, I I just can't. I'm sorry. Oh, no. No, you're right. I, uh, um, I'm oh, gonna love. walk away. What about that thing at the top of the zipper twat? The, uh, spinning orb of death? From what you told me, it must be connected to something beyond the veil. Yeah, isn't that whispering one? One of our holy men already went to investigate it. What is that orb? I asked that last episode and oh my god. Hopefully it's not dangerous. So, you sticking around a while or what? <laughs> you get used to being a hero. 
A druid loves her trees. Whoa, I think I peed a little. Sure did, buddy. Uh, guys, I kind of can't hold this for too long. Right, there Gotta go. In. <laughs> I got you, buddy. Pike. Oh, thanks, Pikey. <laughs> Pikey. Oh, okay. I can't really nice. Break, She's actually there. So this tale is far too great for a lousy book. No, our legend shall be told in song. Oh, well, he is the bard after all. Yes. Uh, Grog loves it. With the epic legend of Mox Machina. Machina. Excellent timing to renounce the throne and cede the government to the Council of Tal'Dorei. Oh, wow. These wise patriots shall ensure that Iman stands forever. Now, in addition to the council members you already know, no. we will be adding a few more. Uh, Dragon? All right. Specifically, Pillars of the community who have held up Dragon? No fucking way. Gods above us. Dragons! Huh? No. Dragons! Yo! No! <laughs> Dude! They did it again! Ugh. Dragons. <laughs> oh. Dude. Oh my, I just got like so red. Like, dude, I anticipated it just cutting off and it happened. You know how I feel about that. People have watched my reaction. You know how I feel about those. Those damn cliffhangers. I don't care if we got enough information. It felt like, dude, I want to see more. So... I, I'm invested and I have to see more now. Dragons? Plural? Come on, dude. Can't wait for season two. What a, what a show. You know, like, oh. A few questions I just gotta say. Like, a few, I had a few questions about the Whispering one. We didn't see him, but like some of you have said in the past reaction in my comments, I have to wait maybe even a couple seasons from now. So I can probably cool it with the questions. I'm, I'm kind of getting ahead of myself. I really did think Keyleth was gonna die. Um, I'm glad that Pike is back too. I didn't think that we would see her in this episode because she wasn't there in the end. But she's back too with the crew. I love that we saw the, the, the whole ghost thing with Percy. I didn't know if Percy was going to be like, it was just him or it was a Jekyll and Hyde situation. But it was a whole monster. It was a whole demon. And everybody he was killing, everyone he was taking vengeance on was feeding the soul. It was feeding, basically, yeah, it was souls feeding the demon. And he got stronger and stronger in the end when he killed everybody. Pretty much almost killed Delilah, but in the end, it ended up being his sister who killed her. And that was a cool kill, too. She just stuck the sword right through her and didn't even, like, let any... She didn't let anyone talk. She just fucking stuck it in her neck, dude. And it it had a cool shot where she was covered in blood and Percy wasn't, which I thought was kind of interesting to see. Because this guy was so bloodthirsty, but it ended up being Cassandra saving Percy in a way. You know what I mean? They, they saved each other. So, it, that was a cool dynamic there. And with with that ghost, like I had questions about how he was even made, where he came from. I didn't, I don't have any more questions about that. It really just answered it for me, like where it came from. When he made the pepper box, it was like a deal with the devil. But my only thing is when he shot his hand, it's like, I don't think we've seen him get shot in the entire show. I don't think we've seen him get hurt when he was with Vox Machina, did we? He shot his hand and it's like the thing spewed out of him. It, 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 
it flew away. It, it, dis it disappeared. Looks like him and the demon it just severed. They severed the bond. Scanlan threw the pepper box into the acid, and it just dest it destroyed it. That's it. I'm glad that nobody died. I know in Dungeons and Dragons, anybody can die in these episodes. Like one bad roll, and they're just dead. I know that can happen. So it was a little. I was a little on edge with like Keyleth. I'm, I'm glad she's not dead, but I thought she was gonna die. Like you don't you don't know what these episodes and people are saying it's it's much more tense you know with the dice people you might have control over that with the show you don't because it's the showrunners that makes sense but of course if i know i didn't watch the the stream so i didn't know i just didn't know what was going to happen and that's that's the fun of this and that's why i think i'm going to wait to watch season two or the next um the next stream when they do the next story for vox machina on a critical role so I'm just going to wait until the show actually comes out. The Whispering one wasn't in it. Didn't look like the ball sucked that dude up into it and sent to another realm, I think one of them said. So, like I like I said, we'll probably see that in the next season or a few seasons ahead. Whatever that was, it, it it's open for interpretation. And that's also good because it has me thinking about what's going to happen. This show is going to continue on. And that's good. This isn't it. There is more to the story, everybody. And that is what I'm most excited for. This isn't it. Overall, every episode had its own thing going for it. Every like there was always some weird monster. There was also some backstory with characters. It just gave me enough meat on the bone. Like I was saying previous to this reaction, enough. There was enough story for everything. Like sure, there could have been more. There could have been more. Like forty-five minute episodes would have been fun, but you can only do so much with a budget and and all of the animation that you need to do. It's it's enough though what I got for this this show and this season as a as a non critter at first this was plenty of content, plenty of story to get me familiar with the characters. I'm getting the characters' names right whenever I see them on screen. It had me invested the whole time, and that's that's obviously a plus for this show. For example, Game of Thrones like season three is when I started to get people's names, and that had ten episodes in it, and the episodes were an hour long. There was just so much in that show, and for it's just a comparison. Might not be the best comparison, but I got people's names already in this show because I feel like it was more interactive with the characters, and it had its own set of uh, like its own set of characters. The Vox Machina crew, there were quite a few of them, but you just you just get into you know you get introduced to their stories and all of their powers and who they are and their personalities, and it really it's a really interactive experience getting getting to know them because the people who voice act them are actually them pretty much in their campaign. So it's just such a fun interactive experience, the whole Vox Machina story. So bravo to that, really. Like bringing this from tabletop to, to television. Bravo. Thank you for checking this out. And if you're tuning in this long, definitely let me know anything I missed. If you guys want to talk, I will definitely heart and talk to everybody else in the comments for this episode. Thank you so much for checking this out. My name is Hunter W. And that will be all for the Vox Machina reaction, season one. Season two coming soon, hopefully. And as always, guys, take care. Bye-bye.